have currently in our inventory are a bunch of Aries 8s, B18s, MTX 218s and CM15s. Uh, the reason we went with audio focus is because of its size to power ratio as well as the fact that they are an actively powered system helps us deploy the system much easier, quicker in most venues around the country. So the reason we went in for the Aries 8 system and this little package is because it packs a lot of punch in a small package. The size to power ratio is brilliant and helps us to uh, cover most venues with pretty much no effort at all. Uh, a big PA with a small delay stack in larger venues, whereas just the flown system, the LR um, in, in, in mid-size venues works absolutely perfect with the AEZ. So here at Reynolds, we like to spend good time in pre-planning and prepping our systems for shows to come. So with Ease Focus, that enables us to do that very easily with the Aries 8. Uh, we can pop in a system, pop in venue dimensions, get a prediction done so that we know exactly what we're going to hear once we're in the venue. Uh, it really helps speed up the process and Ease Focus all the way. <laughs> The Audio Focus Aries 8 and B18, one of my most favorite combinations from the uh, Audio Focus Aries line. Uh, I really love the way this system integrates with each other. It's very easy to either ground stack or fly the system. Uh, the way the uh, hardware is integrated with the box is awesome. The In a ground stack situation, the tops could sit and lock into the subwoofers just like it is here or it could be flown with the subs on top and the, the tops hanging below it. It helps in uh, low frequency coverage thrown to the back of many venues. This is really uh, versatile, especially when we move into smaller venues. Uh, you do theater, corporate, uh, small to mid-sized musical events in auditoriums. Uh, takes up less of footprint than most systems out there and packs a punch. So it's, it's pretty great, pretty versatile. So something that really got me with this um, little system are the single B18s, the single 18 subwoofers by Audio Focus. It's really great because uh, with its integrated rigging, you could fly the subwoofers and then rig the PA right below it, you know, get better sub coverage to the back of venues. Uh, it's very easy to deploy in cardioid configurations as well. Um, very versatile, can move into smaller venues, packs a punch and hence uh, a system like this is, is our go-to for most uh, troublesome applications. The CM15 by design is a coaxial speaker and by virtue of being that is a very good sounding speaker right out of the box. Uh, it's very versatile because uh, it's got a freely rotatable horn uh, that can do uh, various angles uh, which helps us to tailor the wedges placed on stage for musicians. It depends whether we're using two wedges, uh, single wedge, change the angle and it's done. It's, it's really quick, it's really easy. No nuts and bolts, you just pop the lid off, a uh, couple of screws to swap the horn around and you know we've got a we've got a speaker with a different coverage so it's very versatile as a flow wedge it's very versatile as a point source speaker on a stand it can be deployed uh, as a distributed system all over it's got a very intuitive uh, pole mounting option which helps us to angle the speaker differently while mounted on a pole which is also very useful definitely the presets uh, save a lot of uh, time and effort in EQing monitors when they use these wedges or vice versa With respect to uh, the Audio Focus Network Manager, I am actually itching to get my hands deeper into it because uh, it is very viable with the new system that is the Aries 8 HQ and the newer models like the Venue and stuff. Um, 
very interested to know considering that it lets you access all the DSP that's within the amplifier, hence making it even more flexible, easily tunable and deployable all over the place. Uh, hello everyone. Hi, Jack, can you hear me? Yeah, yeah, Rohit. Uh, hello everyone. Uh, hi, my name is Rohit. Uh, I'm the product uh, manager for Sun Infinite Place in Mumbai. Uh, along with me here is Alex uh, from Audio Focus uh, Belgium, and I have my colleague Vijay from Chennai, who is also a product specialist uh, based in Chennai. Uh, so here uh, today we are here to actually uh, know about Audio Focus, uh, the products made by Audio Focus uh, uh, from the the masters in the Audio Focus. That's Alex. Uh, so uh, stay tuned. Uh, we're going to start immediately. Uh, over to you, Alex. Hello, guys. Uh, first of all, good to see you. Uh, thanks for all the participants for joining us today for your time. So today we're going to uh, explain you uh, and talk about with your focus, its range of speakers. We're not going to be too technical. Uh, we want to, uh, to go quickly uh, for you simply to remem remember key features of our range of speakers, who we are, what we are doing, what we have to offer, what kind of support we are giving to our customers in India. So uh, we want to be brief and, uh, uh, and pretty fast. So I think it will take uh, a small hour uh, of presentation and we are going to end with um, question and answer uh session at the end of the presentation so uh jay just a quick, quick question jay Reed, you will uh, keep um adding people that want to join uh, the presentation yeah. yes yeah. we'll do that we we'll see yeah. the people still joining us yes yes yeah. absolutely yeah. We'll do that. great so i don't need to so i'm just going to share my screen and then we can start Okay, so as I said, uh, Audio Focus is from, from Belgium. For those that don't know, Belgium is a very small country of 11 million inhabitants located in the center of Europe, actually is the capital of Europe, uh, holding all the European institutions. Uh, Audio Focus uh, started its business in 2001. So actually almost 20 uh, years old company. It's so uh, electroacoustic manufacturer. So our main job is to make the conception, the design, the assembly of the components and the distribution in Belgium. So all the departments are located under one single roof. And this philosophy is uh, from day one and it will be maintained. So we are pretty small team, small company of 25 passionate team members. And another key uh, date to remember is that our international expansion started in 2010. So before that, uh, we were selling mainly locally in Belgium, in France. And starting from 2010, we started to expand internationally outside the European Union. So uh, of course, between 2001 and 2010, we were selling to Netherlands, to Germany and other European countries. And from 2010, we uh, are selling over the world. And so nowadays, uh, you can find uh, a partner, a distributor um, or a dealer in 45 countries on five continents. So here is the world map when you can find easily uh, all the Udifocus systems and solutions. Uh, who is Udifocus? So uh, as you know, there is a lot of brands, a lot of systems available on the market. It's a highly competitive market. And uh, I want to talk to you about uh, our key features. Who is Udifocus? So basically our DNA, our very strong deep DNA. So Udifocus is offering, is providing uh, the best ratio quality price systems available on the market in order to have a very high and very fast return on investment. For example, uh, 
if you want to invest in a top level brand, uh, which is usually a rider brand, uh, usually they offer you five, seven years credit. Why? Because the investment is very important and is very high. With Urifocus in comparison, uh, you can make your return on investment maybe in one, maybe in two years. So you are reducing your risk because uh, you can maybe project yourself in the next year, in two years ahead. And so you have a very clear uh, visibility on in, in, in the future. If you need to uh, make projection five, seven, 10 years ahead, is more complicated, especially in the crisis periods. So Udifocus is providing plug and play solutions. Basically, thanks to our self-powered systems, uh, we work with exclusively with PowerSoft company uh, for 10 years already. We believe at Udifocus, we believe that uh, self-powered systems is the future of the touring industry. Since day one, uh, our founders, uh, the idea was to build a very durable and re reliable systems. So this is uh, one of the main and the core concerns of Udifocus is to make and to build reliable systems that will be durable uh, with our customers. We try to provide you flexible and polyvalent systems, of course, by using only only European components inside in order to guarantee its availability and its quality on the long term. So we focus also providing complete solutions, not simply boxes with softwares to control, to manage your systems. Um, uh, we believe, so this is how we position ourselves as an alternative to top rider brands, uh, not in terms of price, but in terms of sound quality and performances. And of course, Udifocus is a human-sized company when you can easily reach the founders, the technical and engineers uh, people, or the commercial uh, people to assist you with your projects. Our vision of Udifocus is to build state-of-the-art technological and advanced loudspeakers by using only European components, as I said and mentioned, to guarantee quality, reliability, and durability of the loudspeakers in the long term. And the mission of Woody Focus is to provide lightweight, compact because size and weight could be an issue. So the speakers might, must be the lighter as possible, the more compact as possible. Of course, easy to rig, uh, to deploy, uh, polyvalent and flexible, uh, preferably available in stock because uh, we understand uh, sometimes the cash flow issues of the customers. So uh, you need to get your system as fast as possible. So we try to maintain stock locally in India or uh, in our warehouse in Belgium in order to be able to ship uh, quickly uh, for our customers uh, because show uh, must go on and show must start uh, as fast as possible powerful system with high performances and all of that, all those key parameters that you request and then you should get, of course, for a reasonable and fair investment. As I said, uh, Udifocus is a small, medium-sized company. So as I said, 25 passionate people, but uh, we are partner of the main leader manufacturers out there. Uh, so we have very close uh, relationships with the leaders uh, 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 in our industry that manufacture uh, loudspeakers and drivers, so the components, I mean. Uh, we work exclusively with PowerSoft that we believe also is the number one in the power amplification uh, uh, manufacturer. Uh, we work closely with our uh, DFM. Uh, it's a DSP manufacturer that uh, provide Udifocus tailor-made solutions for our speakers. Uh, we work, of course, with FMG. They are creating softwares uh, for acoustic uh, simulations for any type of venue, uh, for the live sound venues or for the installation, any kind of projects. You can uh, uh, use their softwares, which is the most popular is Ease Focus or Ease for 3D modulations. 
Uh, Udinate uh, is uh, providing Dante uh, solutions and connectivity. Uh, very interesting for uh, installation system integrator. Um, and the vast majority of all our speakers are available with Dante. So uh, it's very interesting to, to have this. And if you like to, to read more, I invite you to, um, to, to go to any uh, partner website to read more about their uh, solutions. So we teams up, we partner with all these major manufacturers in order to provide to our customers and to our market the best and the most reliable systems that is possible. So let's have a quick video from our partner. So yes, we had a small overview of the factory tour and uh, now we're going to pass to the solutions that UDI Focus is providing. So mainly we um, offer three uh, uh, possibility to our customers, uh, passive systems uh, with or beyond solutions with external amplifiers. This is uh, mainly for the installation market where it's required. But for the touring uh, market and for the touring customers, we provide only self-powered systems with PowerSoft. Dante systems could be also provided for some uh, touring applications, but mainly it goes for the installation uh, market. 
So here you can see that the, uh, the installation has basically three choices to choose from passive beyond solutions, self-powered or Dante and Turing uh, has two opportunities to select either self-powered systems or uh, with Dante uh, network. Our market, so the market of Uri Focus is mainly divided in three levels represented by the top, uh, top level uh, or A class level, uh, depends how you mention it. Uh, this level is uh, filled by with uh, top brands, which are often rider brands, which are uh, requested by demanding artists. So basically, to be honest, this level is kind of locked. Uh, it's locked by hundreds of sound engineers that are on payroll of those brands. So it's very, very difficult to enter uh, to this level to a new brand or to even a, a older brand, but it's very, very difficult to enter this rider uh, uh, niche. Very, it's a very niche. Then there is a lot of uh, mid-level brands, B uh, brands that uh, are offering various different uh, solutions with various uh, return on investment. So this is where Udifocus is located as a very strong top higher B brand, uh, but we tend also to the premium brands in terms of sound quality and in terms of sound uh, performances. So this is where we invite all our customers and all the industry is to make thoroughful analysis of different options and different solutions that you have in order to make the best choice for your today's needs and for your tomorrow's needs. And then the, of course there is the entry level brands that are mainly meant for cost oriented customers for whom the sound quality is not the number one choice. Let's have a very brief, uh, quick overview of our range of speakers. So from left to right, on the left, uh, we can see venue uh, range of speakers. It's a multifunctional uh, uh, boxes, a multifunctional series uh, that you can use uh, as a simple uh, box, uh, as a pole mounted with the sub in a typical left-right configuration or uh, as a stage monitor. So basically it's a very multifunctional uh, series meant for the near field. So as you can see, for up to 30 feet. So this is near field. Then we have uh, FRX series. So this is a highly modular and flexible system uh, that you can build uh, upper uh, on with time. So start with one box, uh, great for uh, uh, front of house, from left to right typical configuration for a central cluster. Uh, very modular because you can also uh, rig them uh, uh, horizontally or vertically, you can stack them on your subwoofers, on your stage, you can fly the system. So uh, very, very flexible. I will um, present you uh, more features uh, later uh, with the slides. So let's go on. Then we have the CM. CM is coaxial monitor, also a multifunctional speaker because you can use the palm mount and, uh, uh, for distributed system. Then we have the range of the line arrays. RS, uh, very popular. You have double eight and double 12. So this is medium to long throw line array from 160 to 300 feet distance and their companion subwoofers, the well acclaimed MT sub 218, uh, which goes with RS8 and the new S series uh, uh, that goes with the RS12 or with FRX system. The venue series, um, great for a uh, conference room, for uh, musicians, for bands, for uh, small to medium size uh, companies that are working uh, in touring uh, segments, um, conference pitches, uh, great box, uh, highly polyvalent and flexible. The most important feature is that this box um, is very compact and lightweight. So size and weight are important. Available in four version, uh, 8, 10, 12, and 15 inch to fulfill your uh, specific needs. Uh, so the key features of this venue series is that, as I said, the size and the weight, 
so they're very compact and very lightweight, suitable for clubs and for the live sound uh, gigs. Uh, there is a very uh, user-friendly tiltable power mount. So actually you have four positions, four angles uh, of turning uh, that five angle inclination. So uh, it's very easy to set up and use the, the needed angle for your configuration. You don't need any extra accessories. This uh, venue series you can control and monitor through Audio Focus Network Manager by simply downloading the software. You can connect to the speaker through the Ethernet cables and you have access to the management of the, uh, of the boxes. As I said, you can also use this uh, loudspeaker on, on the floor as a stage monitor uh, and the venue 12 and 15 inch has also a rotative horn 100 by 60 degrees. So you can uh, uh, reduce the reflection on the reflective uh, surfaces if you have a wall on the left on, on your right, or you can segment your audience. Uh, with, so the, very, the venue series is available with a, a huge sort of accessories to mount the loudspeaker on the truss, on the wall. Uh, you have plenty of M8 insert. So you can uh, use cost-effective uh, rigging solution to, to rig your system if you need so. And a picture of uh, the wedge uh, monitoring uh, application. The FRX series, so this is a high-end uh, system for, meant for medium throw application up to 100 feet. Uh, as I said, very, very modular flexible you can build this, any kind of system that you like uh, use uh, a single top uh, uh, box uh, typical uh, top sub left right configuration uh, you can use it as a front fill you can use it as a central cluster uh, you can rig it uh, vertically or horizontally uh, meant for up to 2000 people uh, with a very nice spirit of plug and play system. Uh, you can quickly set up and uh, the system or the mounted. Uh, and so this is where you are actually uh, have all your advantages by having self power system with uh, easy and user friendly rigging. Uh, you can mount very powerful system uh, quickly. And so you are saving time uh, on this deployment and time is money you don't need with self power system you don't need you know to carry on all these heavy cables and long cables you don't need to have rack uh, amplifiers uh, that are heavy uh, so you need less space in your warehouse you need less space in your uh, truck uh, during the transport so it goes faster to deploy the system uh, by having all these presets uh, you have you're saving a lot of time actually a lot of time in the deployment and so this is where you have your advantage the FRX system uh, has a magnetic grill uh, so easy to remove to have access to the horn which is rotative 80 by 30 so uh, again if you have a reflective surface you can easily avoid it or if you want to segment your audience you can do it so have a long throw or, or a narrow throw um, perfect for clubs, for live sound application, front of house, theaters, any kind of job that you want to create with the system. The most important with the FRX that it's not just a black box. Uh, there is a XCOM technology inside. So this is kind of psychoacoustic phenomenon uh, that's on, on your earring system. Then you have the feeling uh, that there is just one source playing. Just one source when you have, when you're coupling three, four, more boxes and you walk around uh, to up to 50 feet uh, you don't have this comp fear of effects you know uh, where you hear four woofers playing actually you can hear only one so you have the feeling so this is what i'm saying psychoacoustic phenomenon you have the feeling there is just one source there is just one woofer you don't have the maximum the maximum and the minimum uh, uh, between the boxes you have very homogeneous sound in front of your boxes. And so this is a nice uh, uh, particular particularity of the FRXs. And so we call this technology uh, XCOM, thanks to the proprietary uh, system inside. Some uh, typical um, 
configuration. So uh, 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 you can see deployment in a club for 2000 people with three boxes per side in a huge arena uh, as a cluster uh, center, uh, as a side fields, uh, wedding rooms, uh, ballrooms. So you can go up to 2000 people with three boxes per side. Let's see a video uh, sent by a customer from Germany that's deployed three FRXs per side with three empty sub 218 subs uh, for 2000 uh, gig. <laughs> I've got this thing gonna blow your mind Pulling your string, helping you unwind I've got this thing gonna break you down You're crumbling till you hit the ground You want to know Okay, let's switch to uh, monitors, professional stage monitors, which are coaxial, so the, the sound is very great. Uh, it's available in 12 and 15 inches, so with a very in, in a very compact size. So uh, it's very easy to carry on on the stage, to move it around. Uh, also, it has magnetic grills, the same as FRX. So easy to get access to the woofer. So coaxial, the, the horn is inside the, the woofer and it's rotative. So you can also uh, adjust uh, the needed uh, directivity for your venue. It has also the same XCOM technology inside, as I have explained with the FRXs. If you couple several monitors in front of the artist, you can select the, the right preset uh, with the XCOM, and then you have this uh, psychoacoustic phenomenon. Uh, very compact, very lightweight. Uh, a lot of sound engineers, artists, bands, uh, singers simply love it. So uh, it's a great box, powerful, multifunctional, as you can see on this picture, you have also the palm mount, so you can use it as a, in front of house application as well. done this at the show so I find it a funny video okay a uh, few uh, illustrations so uh, same monitors are used uh, and appreciated by medium and large uh, scale rental companies that uh, that have a demanding artist so the sound of the box sounds really great and uh, with a very punchy and powerful uh, sound okay Let's jump to the RS8 uh, series. So uh, one of our best seller actually, available uh, in, its, in their installation version, the RS8A, uh, the new RS8 HQ box uh, with control and monitor uh, management possibilities and the, double, and the RS12, which is a double 12 inch line array. To have a quick, quick overview of the companion subs, so, for the RS8, uh, you can use B18, which is a single 18 inch bus unit with integrated rigging uh, for uh, stack or uh, flown configuration coupled uh, with the RS8. 
Then you have the RS12A uh, line array, which goes with S21, single 21 inch subwoofer, and uh, MT sub 218, uh, double 18 inch subwoofer goes with RS8A line array. Few picture of different kind of uh, venues, events. Um, so the RS8A, it's a medium long throw line array, double eight with DSP control connectivity on board. So all the presets are inside the box. You don't need to do any kind of uh, processing. We have done this job for you. So you simply need to select the right preset following the number of elements. That's it. If you have four box, you select the preset for four box. If you have six box, you select the preset between four and eight boxes, for example, etc., etc., etc. So the RS8 is meant for audiences from 200 to 5,000 people. So it's very flexible. You can do whatever you want. You can you you have a very various um, offer of different accessories that provides you this needed flexibility. So you can use one top, two tops on a speaker stand, uh, on the subwoofer directly or on the stage uh, for small gigs, for small events, or you can uh, fly your system with more boxes for bigger venues. Scalable up to 24 elements per side. So uh, great uh, for corporate events, for auditoriums, for concert halls, for arenas, for theaters, or for any kind of jobs, actually. So this is the most polyvalent speaker that you can find. And it's a line array with a true cylindrical waveform. So uh, great for indoor and outdoor gigs. Don't worry about the rain. Uh, the speaker goes with a rain cover to protect the amplifier at the back side. So uh, it's great. Uh, you have a high level of uh, sound quality. Uh, it's durable. And this is the best seller that we have in, at OD Focus. So few picture to, to see. Uh, any kind of configuration that you can create with this box, 360 degrees venue, arenas, ice halls, concert halls, auditoriums, theaters, uh, again, concert halls. So up to 5,000. Actually, uh, some customers, with, uh, they have the, the deployed the maximum amount of elements, 24 boxes per site, and they did 7,000 people with this uh, deployment. Uh, live sound, outdoor events, uh, any kind of configuration, as I said. Uh, we have dozens of uh, great installation in theaters, in cultural centers, in, uh, in churches all across the world uh, with B18s, without B18s, by four, by six, by eight, by 12 boxes per side, any kind of venues. So different kind of uh, accessories. So you can directly mount the line array uh, on your subwoofer with great uh, level of stability. And so uh, it's highly flexible. You can stack, uh, you can fly. Uh, sometimes you, you don't have the, the flying possibilities or the venue do not permit it to fly it. So you can stack it as well. But also some small gigs. Uh, a lot of customers of Audio Focus actually start with four boxes and two subs. Two boxes per side and one sub per side. And you can already uh, start with this investment and then uh, with time invest in a similar system and again and again in order to increase your inventory and get access to uh, bigger events. So highly flexible and uh, modular system. Uh, let's have uh, now a very quick video, a testimony video of the past uh, comparison that we have made uh, in Belgium with an acoustic SCARA system in 2015. So just before starting the video of the testimony of several customers uh, from Europe and from Asia, uh, I just want to, to give you the information how it was made. So the comparison event was absolutely uh, transparent and objective means that we uh, selected um, a similar system, which is Akara. They have exactly the same uh, technical uh, characteristics that RS8 has. Uh, we have invited L Acoustics 
to Belgium in order to control, to deploy their system, to tune their system in order to have absolutely objective event. And they agreed. Actually, an application engineer from Paris, from El Acoustics, uh, came to Belgium for two days. He mounted the system, he tuned the system, he made sure that his systems sound the best. And when he did all of that, uh, uh, after a couple of hours, we deployed our system in 10 minutes and uh, we did the shootout uh, in front of uh, a little bit less than 100 persons uh, that were present in order to demonstrate our capabilities uh, side by side with a well established uh, system, uh, which is Kara. So let's now jump to YouTube. Uh, why YouTube? Because uh, in this way, we have also the subtitles for you uh, to, to read. My name is Doha Wahara with Motion Image and Sound from uh, Nairobi, Kenya. We just listened to the, uh, the new system, the ARI. Very good. Love the brightness. There's a lot of clarity, especially in the top end. We're looking to enter it into the East African market um, very soon, along with ideally distributing for all of East Africa. This system will do very well over there. It's durable, it's easy to put up, and it just sounds fantastic, you know, especially against Again, something as established as, as the car. It's, uh, it's a fantastic system and uh, highly recommended. Good morning, I'm Tom Pardon, the van of um, We are a uh, video company and uh, we have in audio invested. And we are very tevreden with Audio Focus. Uh, Sterke price quality. Bonjour, I'm Dominique Guillaume Caetan. I'm the responsible of Society Showworks. We are the user of the RES for uh, almost an hour and a half now. On est vraiment très 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 content du système et aujourd'hui on est venu écouter effectivement le, la comparaison avec le, le CARA qu'on connaissait avant et effectivement c'est extrêmement concluant, deux très très bons systèmes, deux excellents systèmes et on reste sur la RES. Bonjour Christophe Dison, euh, éclairage diffusion, euh, je suis venu à la démo comparative parce qu'il se fait que je suis propriétaire de CARA et de d'ARES donc euh, c'est un... C'est un beau challenge d'avoir pu prendre ces deux systèmes et les comparer et se rendre compte que euh, ben, le, le CARA est trois fois plus cher, mais la reste ne va pas trois fois moins bien. My name is Andrea Schneider, the CEO of the BIA Group International. We have four offices in the world wide and we are a special installation company and we are really funny to found a new sound system here in Belgium. I think the RS system is a very open system. Uh, today we have, the, you see directly the system on the backside and also we have checking with the line release system from Electro 6 and I think it's a really open and clean system. For me it's totally interesting. We have a lot of big sound systems here in Europe and it's the first time I see and I feel the open sound systems here. I like the system and I hope I can back in very fast time. And so, after this comparison uh, that we made in 2015, sorry for that. After uh, this uh, comparison, uh, a lot of customers worldwide uh, in Africa, in Asia, in Europe, uh, in Latin America started to make their own uh, comparative uh, uh, for to win the project actually. And we have dozens of uh, successful uh, projects that we won thanks to this shootout. So as you can see here on the picture in a, in a theater that we won, uh, RS8 side by side with Cara, S18s um, flown uh, compared to SB18. So uh, we invite all our customers to be open-minded and to test and compare different systems that are similar in um, technical, uh, with technical parameters in order to make their own choice of what is the best for them. 
We also, as I said, so we are open not only to acoustics. So we made, we may, we are making a lot of different comparison with several brands, uh, DNB, with Adamson, and in this case, recently we have made uh, another um, a comparison with Adamson S10. So it's a double 10 inch. Uh, line array, which is becoming very popular internationally. So this is why we selected it to be compared with our new RS8 HQ system, which is still a double eight, so smaller and more compact. We have made this comparison uh, by an independent sound engineer uh, in order to have an objective, um, an objective, an objective report uh, uh, and uh, informations. So just here you can see quickly few uh, important information that came out after this uh, comparative event. That's uh, the feeling is that RS8HQ sounds more like a 3D, S10 is like a little bit more aggressive, but less open, so the reactivity is smaller. Uh, we have uh, uh, compared three single 21 uh, with four S119 subs. And we find out that three S21 are more powerful than four subwoofer from Adamson, and which are, uh, by the way, more expensive also. So uh, single 21 projects the sound further and has 3 dB more starting from 100 feet than the S119. Uh, and also the S10 limiter start uh, a little bit earlier than the RS8 HQ. So, Again, double eight compared to double 10, and we find out that the system is more powerful. So why not to try out, right? Empty sub uh, 218 is as also well acclaimed uh, subwoofer inside the range of speakers and is the companion sub of the RS8 line array. It has a unique design inside uh, unique design only at the defocus. It's a mix between bus reflex and T-line technology. Uh, there is, uh, of course, a power soft class D amplifier with uh, DSP on board. Uh, you have several presets uh, with cardio preset as well. High output, 142 dB SPL peak. This is pretty high for a, for a sub, 4000 watt peak power. So steady of the art subwoofer, one of the best seller, uh, great companion sub for the RS8, gives you plenty of different flexibility and a lot of kick, a lot of punch um, as well. So this is the RS12 line array. Yes, RS12. Uh, it's a three way. It's a three-way self-powered line array for a large scale application. So for uh, audiences starting, let's say from 3000 up to 20,000 or even more, if you add more boxes, if you have delays, et cetera. Meant mainly for uh, big stages as a main uh, PA system uh, with uh, IF, network, uh, IF network manager. So for control management and monitoring, scalable also up to 24 elements. So it's a three-way uh, double 12 line array with a cylindrical wave guide and uh, eight uh, small three inches uh, woofer for the, only for the meats. So with a, a great uh, sound uh, voice clarity. <laughs> Yes, RS12 still. Uh, great for live sound application, but also for installation. So here we installed uh, 16 RS12 in a concert hall uh, with 4, 000, for, with 3,500 3, seats. 
And in this concert hall, uh, several international artists and singers already performed on RS12, on RS8, and together with coaxial monitors, the CM15 as well. So just to name a few, Anastasia from USA, Yanni from Greece, I believe he also came to India, uh, Julio Iglesias from Spain. So actually this is uh, the father of Enrique Iglesias, uh, he also an artist and very famous in the world. Jason Derulo, a rapper from USA. Filip Kirkorov, a national artist from Russia. Ina, a DJ from Romania. Keiko Matsui with her orchestra from Japan. And just to name a few. RS12 is great for big, medium-sized uh, stages, a few events. So a few pictures from the different artists that performed on RS12. And here uh, I would like to play a small testimony from uh, one owner of the RS12 system uh, that purchased it uh, two years ago. My name is Adrian Lam. I'm from St. Kitts and Nevis. I discovered Audio Focus two years ago at, in Frankfurt. And I really love the sound. So we went back listened to the Aries 12 and then went to Belgium. They love the country of Belgium and listened to Audio Focus for a week, checking all the different speakers and meeting all the wonderful people at the factory. I'm Ricky McCall, sound engineer for Tucan Sound. We have recently purchased Aris 12. I really like the system for high-end clarity and vocal response. And I can't first say the mid-bass response and the low-end response. I mean, this PA has everything we need to deliver all that we need to our clients. And I want to advise everybody um, try out your focus. It's as good as many, good as any, and better than many. The system sounds fantastic. Uh, you know, it has everything. Uh, the full range, it, it sounds like we don't even need to put any bottoms there, but um, we did put in a few. The highs are really crisp, and the voice, that's the, the thing that really, the voice is wonderful. It just stands in front of everything. And um, you really don't have to work too hard to get a good voice sound. I, I think it's going to be a really wonderful system and as we get it to grow, it's going to go from string to string. Yeah, so now we are on S21, single 21 inch. That is the companion sub of the FRX 15 and of the RS12. Uh, with BNC woofer inside, a higher output, even more higher than uh, MT sub 218 with 145 dB SPL peak, with eight presets on board, uh, infra preset, cardio preset, and fire preset, bass preset, subwoofer preset. So really, for any kind of needs uh, for your venue, uh, of course, with IF network manager, so for the control and monitoring management. Uh, in order to uh, make a great venue, in order to have you know, the angles for your line array boxes, you need to go uh, to acoustic simulation software, is Focus, and it will provide you the angles needed for your venue. It will also give you the simulation of the performances of your system. So uh, a great tool, uh, uh, free of use, 
with a lot of um, tutorial, a lot of uh, webinars that uh, are held uh, across the world in order for you to get familiar and to know, uh, to get all the skills needed to properly manage the software. We have also, uh, as mentioned several times during this presentation, our own uh, network manager software that is available with almost all the range of speakers. In order to have real-time management and monitoring, you have a view on the temperature of your speakers, on the voltage, uh, you can make a delay again, you have access to, to preset, you can create groups, uh, so it's a very user-friendly and nice uh, manager software that goes, of course, together by default with all the systems. You can, uh, you can download it, uh, this software, on UDFocus website. UDFocus in India is present for the last five years. Um, we are working uh, with Sun Infinite for the last three years and we have done a, a very nice job by having uh, dozens and dozens of customers across India in different states, in different regions. We are maintaining a close relationship with all the customers. So by being a small, we are also very approachable. So any customer can contact UD Focus uh, uh, directly to share pictures, to share, to share their input uh, in close collaboration with Sun Infinite team that are available uh, in different regions. So we are visiting India a couple of times a year. Of course, we are present every year at Palm Show, not this year, but next year for sure. Uh, visiting customers, uh, making trainings, listening to their concern, to their needs, Develop, we develop uh, also different uh, projects together. Um, so yeah, some pictures of our recent visits uh, that we made in January 2020. The support of UD Focus is great and as well. So uh, together with Sun Infinite, uh, um, uh, we are providing technical support, we are providing trainings. Sun Infinite is a well-established company for also 20 years, even more, 30 years actually. Um, so uh, they have four authorized service centers across India, in New Delhi, in Mumbai, in Chennai and Kolkata. Uh, they have spare parts available should you have any issue. Uh, and Urifocus is providing three years uh, limited warranty uh, for our speakers so you can be safe. Uh, uh, and rest assured that your system will be durable on the long term. So now I suggest that we pass to question and answer session. Hi Alex, go to the side. So yeah. we've got a question. Uh, someone wanted to know more about the XCOM uh, technology, uh, which is actually used in your boxes, the points of boxes. Yeah, the Phyrexis, yes. Yeah, so they just wanted to some more like you know what is it? Why are the why are you guys using it and how does it help? So basically, uh, this goes with you know with the so when you couple different uh, boxes together, uh, you have a comp filtering. So this is a technical phenomenon uh, when you have uh, when the sound is um, overlapping with the other uh, sound wave of the other boxes. So. Uh, you, you can hear if you if you take three uh, I don't know whatever two way boxes and you couple together when you walk around them you will you 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 will have the minimum and the maximum between the boxes you will hear there is three woofers three independent woofers playing and so we cancel this feeling by uh, we see XCOM technology so there is no comps filtering there is no uh, comps effect and so the sound is homogeneous. Uh, if you like to, to read more, uh, we can send uh, to these customers uh, more information uh, with uh, pictures uh, explaining uh, how XCOM uh, works. But the best is to hear it because this is a psychoacoustic phenomenon. So you need to hear it to really understand uh, how it uh, works. Thanks for that. Uh, and there's another question that, uh, you know, where this is basically for the install in the corporate market, uh, where uh, is it possible for, uh, you know, flush mount the venue weight inside the wall uh, so that, you know, it, uh, uh, 
to flash mount it inside the wall the when you wait is are there any uh, accessories or something like that where you can actually uh, flash mount into the wall so that you know it the, the the speaker doesn't pop out pop out of the wall so it goes inside and it's on the same surface as the wall is it possible so i think this uh, needs to be analyzed uh, every project is individual uh, we sometimes offer specific and tailor made just for unique project uh, rigging solutions so uh, a lot of things are possible but uh, uh, if if the uh, if there is a, a concrete a project uh, of course we will be happy to analyze it with the customer and to see uh, what is possible to do Thanks. Um, any more questions? If anyone uh, wants yeah. to ask more, they can just. Uh, Rohit, I think there's another question from Mani himself. Uh, what is the latency for the Dante speaker? Like when you FRX ARS is talking about the latency on the Dante speaker. Uh, so this uh, regarding Dante uh, is better to to again to 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 have a clear question and uh, I prefer uh, our engineers to answer this question uh, in order to 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 have a very uh, tailor made answer yeah so so for those of you who want to get a little more technical and want to yeah. uh, we are arranging a separate webinar with Thomas who is uh, part of the r and d team from audio focus we will be shortly uh, doing a webinar with him wherein you can clarify all your technical uh, doubts with him. So, so we will be conducting that. Uh, and there is few more questions. Line array system, how we, uh, how we get sound shaping tool. So I think, I think Jacob, I think you are referring to, uh, so what, what are the, what are the software that we use? The software is basically the AF network manager. Uh, that is a that the is East a, Focus, yes. Yeah, and the, that's and actually the, and the, the yeah the East Focus basically for you to uh, predict uh, the coverage and all of that, and also for you to uh, uh, for the for the boxes to uh, the DSPs and all of that, you can use the AF Manager control software as well. Uh, so I saw the AF Network Manager. Uh, if I yeah, so all these questions. Uh, in regards with uh, your FIR filters and your DSPs and how to uh, deploy and all of this will be taken uh, with Thomas uh, in in the upcoming webinar. So just uh, just so that we make this uh, Q&A a little more interesting, uh, we have already done a, a Q&A with uh, uh, with the Reynolds team. So so we have spoken to uh, uh, Sohail. Uh, the who heads the audio department for for Reynolds, um, so who is who has also been awarded uh, the best system engineer 2019 at Palm. So we just did a small Q and A, and we would like you uh, like to present that video uh, for you right now. Uh, Rohit, yeah, uh, Alex, can you just uh, stop your screen sharing so that I can just share my screen? Yeah. Thanks for that. Okay. Hi, my name is Sohail Dantis and I've been working with Reynolds for the past 10 years. I currently uh, head the audio department and oversee systems for the company. We have currently in our inventory are a bunch of Aries 8s, B18s, MTX 218s, and CM15s. Uh, the reason we went with Audio Focus is because of its size to power ratio, as well as the fact that they are an actively powered system helps us deploy the system much easier, quicker in most venues around the country. So the reason we went in for the Aries 8 system and this little package is because it packs a lot of punch in a small package. The size to power ratio is brilliant and helps us to uh, cover most venues with pretty much 
no effort at all. Uh, a big PA with a small delay stack in larger venues, whereas just the flown system the LR um, in, la in, in mid-size venues works absolutely perfect with the AEZ. So here at Reynolds, we like to spend good time in pre-planning and prepping our systems for shows to come. So with ease focus, that enables us to do that very easily with the Aries 8. Uh, we can pop in a system, pop in venue dimensions, get a prediction done so that we know exactly what we're going to hear once we're in the venue. Uh, it really helps speed up the process and ease focus all the way. The Audio Focus Aries 8 and B18, one of my most favorite combinations from the uh, Audio Focus Aries line. Uh, I really love the way this system integrates with each other. It's very easy to either ground stack or fly the system. Uh, the way the uh, hardware is integrated with the box is awesome. The In a ground stack situation, the tops could sit and lock into the subwoofers just like it is here or it could be flown with the subs on top and the, the tops hanging below it. It helps in uh, low frequency coverage thrown to the back of many venues. This is really uh, versatile, especially when we move into smaller venues. Uh, you do theater, corporate, uh, small to mid-sized musical events in auditoriums. Uh, takes up less of footprint than most systems out there and packs a punch. So it's, it's pretty great, pretty versatile. Something that really got me with this uh, little system are the single B18s, the single 18 subwoofers by Audio Focus. It's really great because uh, with its integrated rigging, you could fly the subwoofers and then rig the PA right below it, you know, get better sub coverage to the back of venues. Uh, it's very easy to deploy in cardioid configurations as well. Um, very versatile, can move into smaller venues, packs a punch and hence uh, a system like this is, is our go-to for most uh, troublesome applications. The CM15 by design is a coaxial speaker and by virtue of being that is a very good sounding speaker right out of the box. Uh, it's very versatile because uh, it's got a freely rotatable horn uh, that can do uh, various angles uh, which helps us to tailor uh, the wedges placed on stage for musicians. It depends whether we're using two wedges, uh, single wedge, change the angle and it's done. It's, it's really quick, it's really easy, no nuts and bolts, you just pop the lid off, a uh, couple of screws to swap the horn around and you know we've got a we've got a speaker with a different coverage so it's very versatile as a floor wedge it's very versatile as a point source speaker on a stand it can be deployed uh, as a distributed system all over it's got a very intuitive uh, pole mounting option which helps us to angle the speaker differently while mounted on a pole which is also very useful Definitely the presets uh, save a lot of uh, time and effort in EQing monitors when they use these wedges or vice versa. Well, with respect to uh, the Audio Focus Network Manager, I am actually itching to get my hands deeper into it because uh, it is very viable with the new system, that is the Aries 8 HQ and the newer models like the Venue and stuff. Um, very interested to know considering that it lets you access all the DSP that's within the amplifier, hence making it even more flexible, easily tunable and deployable all over the place. Yeah, so, so these were some of the questions. Uh, thanks, Rohit. So these were some of the collective questions that we, we've been asked more often. And uh, we thought, why not put all these questions across to someone who, in India who has been using this system a lot. And uh, so there you go with the answers. And uh, thank you so much, Alex. Thank you for uh, thank all you. your time and uh, for putting to, uh, together this webinar. And for those of you who want to get a little more technical, I think uh, you have all our contact details. Alex, if you could share those uh, slides as well. Yeah. 
uh, you can write to us uh, we are uh, we are uh, putting together a webinar shortly uh, 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 much more technical talking about the af network manager the dante uh, networking and uh, what what of what will be your solution and what we can offer for it so so you can you can get uh, get in touch with us you can uh, uh get to our uh, website saninfonet.net or uh, info@sungroup.net or contact either me or rohit uh, uh on any of the queries that you have got and uh, of course uh, there's nothing like hearing the boxes so if you have got uh the urge to listen to the boxes of course after the whole uh, lockdown is done uh, reach out to us uh, there are a lot the, there are boxes around in every city uh we would uh, definitely get to you the boxes so that you can listen to them personally uh before uh, get hands on to them uh and thank you so much thank you so much guys for all your time and i know it's a weekend and thank you so much alex thank you rohit uh, uh and the audio focus team for putting together this thank you thank you guys thank you thank for you, the everyone. support thank you yeah. thank Thanks. you yeah thank you very much for this opportunity thank you